Hello guys, this is Matrix Ray, and I'm showing you a legendary weapon called Maxed Out Poison Bright Sight Plus. I will be showing this weapon off in action, and also we'll be doing some first impressions. It's level 60 with 1757 times 18 damage, accuracy 46%, handling 62%, reload time 2.0 seconds, <clears throat> fire rate 1.31 seconds, magazine size 11, and the red text says it's killing me. Mayhem level 10. Uh, plus 74% weapon damage, consumes 2 ammo per shot, 1.5 times weapon zoom, highly effective versus armor, anointed operative, while digi clone is active, uh, regenerate 12% of magazine ammo per second, it's a TD door, shotgun with 2767 uh, damage per second at 7% chance corrosive. I got this weapon from a well drop in DLC 3. And I got the Mayhem 10 version, as you guys can see. Uh, this gun comes in... Well, I've got the corrosive version. They say radiation and normal damage, so they have to add in more elements for this gun. <clears throat> I'm guessing it does almost all the elements in the game. But actually, the legendary effect, matter of fact, uh, says this. Reload, become, reload becomes a drone that splits into four different elemental drones. Fire, corrosive, radiation, and um, cryo. Let's show you guys this real quick. So as you guys can see, I can shoot, reload, and you can see that there's four uh, drones, which are basically my guns, and they blow up, and there there was fire, radiation, and the other two I kind of forgot already. But yeah, there you go. That's the legendary effect, which is really, really interesting. I am also on Mayhem 10, as you guys can see. Now, I'm going to be using my action skill end very shortly, but I'm going to be using just regular... Uh, Shooting without any extra skills on straight away. See how much damage we're going to be do, uh, dealing. So as you guys can see, I'm going to be uh, shooting this this uh, boss and also getting the legendary effect to show the effects. As you as you guys can see, the legendary effect was shooting the snapper, and it shoots in all these different elements, which is very very nice. So overall, it's a very cool legendary effect. Now let me just do this real quick and shoot at the boss and then shoot and reload. See how much damage we can do. As long as the guns shoot towards the uh, boss, which it doesn't look like it, it's focusing on the snapper. But other than that, yeah, I really like the legendary effect. Unfortunately, the damage is on the real low side, unfortunately. Made by just casually shooting it with the uh, action skill on. The legendary effect didn't take much of an advantage on the, the uh, boss, but at least it's doing a good job on the snappers, which is really nice. From what I'm seeing, this is going to be one of those guns that's going to be really good casually running around just doing missions and stuff like that. On bosses like this, I would probably not recommend it unless if you're using a Mayhem level 10 version. Unlike Mayhem 4 versions of this boss, maybe lower. But other than that, I think this gun is, you know, it's very unique. I like the legendary effect. I think it's definitely worth trying out at some point. Other than that, thank you guys for watching and see you later.